Welcome to your student orientation to Blackboard. In this video, you will learn how to access your Blackboard account, as well as how to use some of the important features within your Blackboard courses. To begin, please go to cfcc.edu. Here, on the home page, you will notice several tabs. You will want to look to the right hand side to find the My CFCC tab, which you will then click on. Here you will need to log into your CFCC Campus Portal page. Please use your given username and current password. Once finished, click on the blue Login button below. From here you will be taken into your CFCC Campus Portal page. We will be focusing on the left hand column called the Launchpad. You will see many options, but for this video, we will be using the My Classes slash Blackboard tab. In Blackboard, this is your home screen. You will notice tools on the left, announcements in the middle, and My Courses to the right. This is where you will find all the courses that you are enrolled in as a student. You can click on one to be taken to a class. You first enter a course in Blackboard you will be taken to the announcements page. Here you will see a welcome message or other important updates from your instructors. You will want to be sure to read through these completely. You can also locate announcements in the left toolbar by clicking on the announcements tab. Next, you will want to look for the enrollment verification tab to the left in your course toolbar. You want to be sure to take the enrollment verification quiz which is a few questions to ensure that you are accounted for in the online course. This quiz verifies that you are present and active within the course. You can click on the link to begin the quiz. Click on begin in the lower right hand corner. Next, you can click on the getting started tab to the left. Here you might find different documents and information relating to course policies, assignments, and netiquette. Be sure to read over this information completely. You will also want to look at your course syllabus. You can click on this tab to find your syllabus for each course. This outlines everything you need to know about your classes. To view your syllabus, you can either click on the document link to open the attached file, or you might find that your instructor put the information directly in Blackboard. You will want to read over this document completely to ensure you understand everything about your course. Back in Blackboard, you will see the course schedule section as well. You may notice that your instructor has displayed this information directly in Blackboard, or it might appear in a separate document as it is here. You can click on the file to then download the document, which you will open in a separate tab. Be sure to look over the course schedule and due dates thoroughly to ensure that you are submitting your assignments on time. This may be broken down into units or different sections. You will also see a calendar on some courses, which will have important dates listed as well. Now, in the Instructor Contact section, you will find your instructor's office hours, location, and contact information, such as their email address and phone number. Now we will take a look at where you will spend most of your time in Blackboard, which is the Coursework tab. Here you will notice that your course is broken down into either different units, sections, or folders. This is where your work for the course will be located. The way your coursework is broken down will vary on each class, but generally each will be broken down into folders. You can look in these folders to find different assignments which you can submit, you may find instructions for the unit, and so on. Be sure to read through all your coursework so that you know what you have to complete. In the Discussion Board and Collaborate tabs, you will find different tools for completing and viewing coursework. You will also notice the grades section where you can find all your current grades, both graded and not yet graded assignments. This is important for keeping up with all your grades throughout the semester. Lastly, the email section allows you to find 
different links to email both your instructor and other classmates in the course. You can also locate the Student Help Resources tab to find support for topics like student services, library resources, and Blackboard Collaborate. Thank you so much for watching, and if you need more help with Blackboard, please visit cfcc.edu slash studenthelpdesk.